with the price of Terra Luna Classic around that point zero 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 nine level, people are putting a lot of expectations and really a lot of pressure on this parity upgrade that we are going to be expecting on none other than June 14th. That is the date we've got from the Layer 1 Task Force, and we've already got people out there claiming that this is going to drive Terra Luna Classic back up to the $1 price point. Now we're going to be talking about that in this video and going over a recent article that I found that states Terra Luna Classic should go back up to a dollar based on parity being reached. So we'll talk a little bit about what parity means, we'll talk about what it means for the Terra Luna Classic blockchain, and of course we're going to discuss whether or not Terra Luna Classic is going to 1200x to reach that one dollar mark based on this upgrade. So if it sounds like something you're interested in, let's get started. What's up, everybody? I'm Clay. I'm here to make 2023 the best year ever. If you haven't clicked that subscribe button, make sure to subscribe to the channel. Join us. Become a bro. We are here every single day, and we are growing our portfolios together. Now, look, if you're brand new to investing, you don't know how or where to buy stocks and crypto, you got a link in the description below for Weeble. <coughs> Super simple to set up your account. Any deposit, you guys are getting at least six free stocks, up to 12 free stocks, and a $1 crypto trade is going to get you $5 in free crypto. If you guys want crypto exclusive exchanges where you can buy, sell, trade, short, leverage, all that good stuff, you get KuCoin and Binance down there. Now, KuCoin and Binance, they offer rewards for the more active traders. So the more you trade, the more you're going to earn. But please be aware, if you guys are holding on those exchanges, it is going to be considered a loan to those exchanges. If you want to mitigate that risk and make it your asset, you need to look at a cold storage or DeFi wallet. Guys, uh, listen, 1,200x gains in Terra Luna Classic to drive the price up to a dollar or a six, almost seven trillion dollar valuation with the current outstanding supply. It, I don't know if it's because people want that level so bad or if it's because they just don't understand numbers. It is not going to be easy at all. To reach six, seven trillion dollar valuations. The entire cryptocurrency market at its peak of the bull market in 2021 was three trillion dollars. Why would Terra Luna Classic drive twice the entire value of every cryptocurrency put together at its peak, or six, almost seven times the value of the entire cryptocurrency market right now? So it is going to be tough. I'm going to say no, that this upgrade is not going to take us to that $1 mark. But let's go ahead and look at this article and see what it means and see what this upgrade is going to do for the Terra Luna Classic blockchain. <clears throat> the headline says, Terra Classic announces official date of parity upgrade, Lunk to $1. Terra Classic developer Joint L1 Task Force, the L1TF, announced the official date of the Cosmwasm V110 parity upgrade. Is Lunk's price $1 next? Terra Classic developer group Joint L1 Task Force, the L1TF, has announced the official date of the Cosmwasm V110 parity upgrade. It is one of the biggest upgrades since the Terra Classic community took charge of the blockchain after the Terra Luna Classic er, crisis in May last year. It will bring Terra Classic to parity with other blockchains such as Terra 2.0 and Cosmos. Terra Classic developer L1TF announces the date for parity upgrade. The Joint Task Force Project Manager, Lunk Burn Army, took to Twitter to reveal June 14th as the official date to the Cosm Wasm upgrade. The upgrade was officially planned for May 31st, but the Terra Classic core developer team decided to add two weeks for additional testing of this major upgrade. The Cosm Wasm upgrade from V0166 to V110 can be completed in four scenarios, but we chose Scenario 4. Just to give you guys an update on what Scenario 4 is, uh, use upgrade handlers, require the contract developers to upload new code for the new VM. Uh, second stage, Genesis upgrade is not required, and re-uploading binaries is not as costly for dApp developers as deploying a complete project. There, you need to assist in uh, the assist. Sorry, assist the existing smart contract owners, and they're going to documentation or issue documentation on how to do so. And there should be no problem in terms of the suspected release date. There are certain prerequisites to successfully complete the parity upgrade. 
Teams completed the v version 1.2.0 upgrade, smart contract unit testing, and it plans to complete the V1.2.0 upgrade testing on the Bajor or Bajor, whatever, however you pronounce it, testnet, and the dress rehearsal upgrade on Rebel 2 testnet by May 31st. So testnet, 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 and everything goes fine. That's when we're going to get the June 14th uh, release here. The Layer 1 Task Force will post an updated Agora proposal on June 1st, and post-governance voting starts on June 7th. The Cosmosm Parity Upgrade will have it on June 14th, assuming everything passes, and I I'm sure that it will pass with flying colors. People want to see this happen very badly. The DApp owners and smart contract providers need to update smart contracts to the V1.1.0 when it comes into play. Now, why is this important? And this article goes on to tell you that, it, you know, with, if there's no issues in upgrading this, it is going to bring us into parity with Terra Luna Classic 2.0, Cosmos, and it is going to allow for builders on those blockchains to build on the Terra Luna Classic blockchain. It says the Cosmosm V110 upgrade is going to bring back utility to the Terra Luna Classic network by allowing projects and builders across the Cosmos and Terra Luna 2.0 to once again build on Terra Luna Classic. Now, here's the weird part. So, it says that it's going to enable Edward Kim, you know, the guy that's doing the, the AI blockchain. It's going to allow him to launch his testnet for AI upgraded blockchain or block entropy. In addition reinstating the burn tax to 1.2% and increasing staking rewards. I don't know if it's going... And this also says, and uh, as well as reviving LUNC and USTC to $1. So I don't know if, if the author of this article is slightly confused that bringing us back into parity with uh, Terra Luna 2.0 and, and the rest of the cosmos here is automatically going to increase the burn tax to 1.2%. That is obviously not going to happen. That's something that we would vote on. It is obviously not going to just strictly increase staking rewards, and it's clearly not going to revive Terra Luna Classic and USTC to $1. Some people might be confused in, in thinking that parity means $1, or parity between you know coins means USTC is pegged to a dollar and Terra Luna Classic is pegged to a dollar. That's not the case. Terra Luna, you know, USTC could receive that peg to one dollar if we get that money to flow back onto the chain there, but that in no way brings Terra Luna Classic to a dollar. Um, so, so that part of the article made me slightly confused there as to whether or not the the author actually believes that. But nonetheless, this is going to be huge, and one of the major benefits is that if people would like to reopen these communications between Terra Luna Classic and these other blockchains, and if they would like to build on the Terra Luna Classic blockchain, it is going to enable them to do so. We know that the more utility we have, the greater the demand should be. The more transactions we have, the greater the burns should be. So it should be beneficial across the board if this comes to be on June 14th. We're going to have to vote on it starting June 7th. So I want to know what you guys think. Right now, I'm in favor. I want to know what you guys think about it in the comments below. Are we voting yes on this one? And of course, if that button right there is still red, make sure to click it. Subscribe to the channel. Join us. Become a bro. We are here every single day. We are growing our portfolios together. Claybro883 everywhere. 6 to 12 free stocks on Weeble, KuCoin, and Binance Free Discord. And until the next time, hopefully each and every one of you have an awesome day.